let me show you how to remove Google Authenticator from BitGet. Now, give this video a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and let's get started. To remove Google Authenticator from BitGet, launch your BitGet app. Now tap on this menu icon here. Now tap on my profile on this arrow that is pointing to the right to access the user center page. Now tap on security tab and here is the Google Authenticator. It is configured. So I'll tap on this. Here you will see the option to change Authenticator or unbind Google Authenticator. So if you want to change, maybe you no longer have access to the old one and you want to start using a new one, you can try this. But if this doesn't work or you want to remove it entirely, choose unbind Google Authenticator. And this is a notice I'll be telling you withdrawals and P2P sales transactions will be suspended for 24 hours following changes in a security item. Deposit and trading remains unaffected. So I'll tap confirm. Here I'm being asked to enter the OTP that was sent to my email and the code that was sent to my phone number and then the Google Authenticator code. So I still have my Google Authenticator. So once I put these three codes, the Google Authenticator will be removed from my BitGet. So, but in case you no longer have access to the Google Authenticator, all you have to do is to tap on this verification method unavailable. So, I'll tap on it. And then here is saying, before you begin, you are about to reset your security method. Customer support will review all your information within 24 hours. So, I'll tap OK. So, here you have to choose the one you no longer have access to. So, here I no longer have access to my Google Authenticator, it's unavailable, it's not working. I'll just choose this and I'll tap confirm. In the next page, here is the email code. Code has been sent to my email and then it has also been sent to my phone number. Once I input these codes now, the Google Authenticator will be removed from my account. Now, I've gotten the code that was sent to my phone number and now I'll input the one from my email, which is 813. 406 and then I'll tap on confirm so see reset successful Google Authenticator resets successful back to home I'll tap back to home so now let me go back to my profile mm -hmm. yeah then security tab as you can see I've successfully removed Google Authenticator from my BitGet and that is all on how to remove Google Authenticator from BitGet. If you find this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and I will see you in the next video.